Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to Final Fantasy VIII. Okay, so last time we did our seed initiation party, we met a mysterious woman who we danced with. We couldn't dance whatsoever, and then suddenly we were the greatest dancer of all time. Quistis pretty much came onto us. She then told us that she's no longer a trainer or whatever the hell she was before. She's a regular seed member, and we've been sent on our first seed mission to Timber. I forget why, but we'll remember when we get there. Also, we won the Minimog card from uh, the little blue-shirted fellow who's been running around. Let me show you that very quickly. It's probably back here. Yes. So now we have the Minimog card and the Ifrit card for our rare card collection. Everything else is a common card, so we can get multiples of those. There is only one of each of these in the game, though there is kind of a way of getting infinite of them, but you know, it's not until Dex 4 and... Uh, yeah, you'll see. So anyway, um... I'm trying to think of something else I wanted to mention. We also got the magical lamp from uh, Sid, so we can summon a GF and find it and then uh, obtain it. I don't know if we're going to be strong enough to do that just yet. Uh, we'll probably give it a try in a second here, but be, just expect that we'll probably die. But you know, uh, we also have a couple of cards that we want. Well, yeah, I guess we need to go win Zelda's card and Quistus's card before we leave the island. Because again, we ain't going to be coming back here for quite some freaking time. Uh, so... Instead of starting the episode by playing cards for 20 minutes, or maybe longer, let's start by, you know, using the lamp and, again, potentially bloody dying. So as you can see, you should save your game before using this. They ain't bloody kidding. This thing I remember being very tough. Let's we'll see how it goes, though. Who dares disturb my slumber? So yes, this is, uh... Diablos or Diablo? I can't write these Diablos. And he has, I believe, Demi and Cure. Now, the good thing about him is Demi only does a percentage of your HP. But he has some other really powerful attacks from what I remember. Now, I ain't gonna spend forever drawing like 100 Demi on everyone here. As you can see, drawing can actually fail if it's kind of a high level ish spell, which Demi is. Gravager, I believe, is basically Demi on everyone. I think it might even be a more powerful version of Demi. It sure bloody is. So. I'm trying to remember exactly how this works. He must have other attacks because, again, since it does a percentage, surely it can never kill you. Yeah, I think so. But let's get a couple more of these. Because, you know, at least we can use them. And I think you may be able to use them on him if I remember correctly. And again, oh, yeah, 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 there you go. Oh, shit. Oh, uh, we're dead. Alright, so, what have we learned? We've learned that, um... We don't have like a life spell or anything, do we? No, we learned that we want at least one person with actually probably at least two minimum with um with the item commands, so we can use a phoenix down. But yeah, as you saw, he don't mess around this stage in the game, so you know that's a thing. Again, I expected that to happen. Plus, I couldn't really remember exactly how the fight went. So yeah, let's go back in with. Well, here's the thing: if we give everyone um. Item. Well, no, I guess what we could do, that's actually a really good idea. Because we no, we're not really going to be using the magic command, at least probably not in combat. Actually, no, that's even better. Can you get rid of the attack command? No, you can't. Okay, attack command's there by default. So I'm thinking maybe get rid of magic fire item. And that way we still have draw. Because again, I'm pretty sure you can use um, his demi on him. And it actually does do a percentage of his HP. So yeah, if that works, it's going to be really bloody hand. Let's save again, just so I don't have to re-equip that every time. Also... I'm pretty sure I just saw Quistis walking around, so let's go have a chat with her very quickly before we go die again. What's up? Hey, Troublemaker, don't mess around too much. I'm pretty sure that's her. Oh, that's not her, is it? Oh my god. I'm terribly sorry. I'm blind, plus, you know, it's an old game. Alright. So, we have to be really on the ball here. I also don't think we have very many Phoenix Downs. We do have some money. And I think there might be a general store in Zell's hometown, so that might be a thing we want to do. Or maybe we'll just wait to use the lamp until we can do that, I guess. But for now, let's just try drawing and casting it on him. I, again, I think this works? But I really don't bloody remember. It's, we're probably going to fail a bunch here. Everybody failed. Son of a bitch. Yeah, it's, they probably want you to fail, because again, if you can use it on him, it's going to make the fight a lot easier. Because I think... I think I remember doing it the first time, it does like 4,000 damage or something ridiculous. So that's why we kind of want this to work if we can. Please, let a brother demo you. I do like the way demo looks, it's very cool. I mean, Gravage is way cooler. I think Gravage is one of those spells that you can't get personally. Maybe I'm wrong, but I don't think you can. I think it's just like demi, demi, ra, demiga or something. 
Yes, 4,000 damage almost. I can't believe I remember that. See, so yeah, we definitely want to do that a few times because that will make the fight a lot bloody bearable. We now need to revive him. We have 10 Phoenix Downs. Hmm. Is that going to be enough? If we can get off a bunch of demis, maybe. But there's really no point us curing people because he'll one-shot them pretty much anyway. And yeah, as you can see, uh, we can actually do our limit breaks when we're low on HP. I think the way it works is it's not a guarantee, but it's like a good chance or something. So let's try using her. Full cure, do-over. Let's do that. It will cast fire out on him twice. Do-over is just like a re-roll so you can try and do something else. Please, bloody do good damage. I'm going to guess like sort of five, 600 each. No, 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 no. Not even close. Okay, good. We got another demi. This one's probably going to do about 2,000. Because, you know, it's going to do about half as much, I think. So we are chipping him down pretty quick. Again, Dem is, uh, Dem is the key to that. Alright, quickly revive him. Uh, what is Zell? It's Jewel. I haven't done this yet, so I don't know how this is going to go. We'll give it a try. But yeah, this is definitely the tactic to beating him early, is just... Have items so you can revive people, and, uh... Up, down. Oh, we have to do it with the analog stick. Shit! It's really annoying. Right, left. I don't know what the hell button 2 is. So I'm going to avoid those for now. Like, I really don't. I wish they just said, you know, like, square, triangle, etc. Okay. We're doing good damage. Actually, pretty good damage. I remember I used to be really fast at this. Up, down. What is button 1, button 2? I think it's like L1, R1, left, right. Yeah, I... It's not all one, apparently. I really don't remember what it is. Man, we're low on HP. Alright, see so if we can get off like one or two more demis, then we'll try to finish him off with uh, a couple of summons or something. This is definitely doable, but... It's just not easy at this point until you get like a shitload of Phoenix Downs. Demi cast, demi cast. If we can get like two more of these off, I think. Okay, one. There's one. How much is this gonna do? Again, the lower it starts doing, that means the less HP he has. Because again, in case I forgot to mention it, it means it does, uh, I think... I think Demi does... Half of your HP? Like, half of your remaining HP. It might be a quarter or something like that. Maybe it's a quarter, then Demi... Ra? Or whatever is half? I, I don't know. And then Demi goes like three quarters. Oh, shit. Yeah, it's really bad. Really bad. No! No, we had him! You see, that's what I mean. He can't, he can't just do it. He's so fast. Shit. Hmm. All right. Do we try him again? I mean, we almost had him, man. We almost had him. Maybe we'll go do some cards just to mix it up a little bit. We'll try him again sort of before the end of the episode. Because, again, we, we can definitely do it. It's just we need him to not combo us like that. Um. All right. So the Quistus card, I believe, you can get in the... Where the hell is it? Oh, it's the cafeteria, I think. The, uh, the treppies, like her groupies are there. This is the cafeteria, that's the quad. Why do I not remember what the quad is? Quad ain't the cafeteria, right? I think this is the cafeteria. Yeah, okay. What is the quad? I guess we'll go check that out in a minute, because I can't remember what the quad is. So I believe there's, like, two dudes here somewhere at the back of the cafeteria. I don't think they always show up. Yeah, they're not here right now. I think they're sort of over... In oh, maybe we can go off screen. Yeah, here we go. I think it's these two. Pretty sure. Which one should I talk to? The guy in front of me, the guy in the back. Got the back, I guess? Yes. How about a quick game of cards? Alright, so again, pretty damn sure they can have the Quistus card. I think either of them can. I don't think it matters. Alright, don't have it yet. Hmm. Again, it usually takes a few games before they pull it out. Alright, so how are we going to take you? Uh, 6 4. Hmm. Man, that's kind of well protected. I guess we can use Mini Mog? Do we want to do that? Yeah, fuck it, let's do that. Yeah, alright, okay. So they're gonna take Mini Mog, there's like no question about that. Yeah. But what we can do is we can take this, and then there's a literally no way they can take anything back. So why would we, know, why would we not do that? There you go. And then, uh, if we do this, we're also guarded again. And then hopefully we can take, yeah, we can take something with, uh, this. And they can't take it back, and we won! Suck it. I guess we'll take the Iron Giants. Yoink! Okay. You're good, play me again. You know, that first card he had there with the long legs, whatever that was, I think that might be the thing you can morph into, uh, a steel pipe. So if we see that show up again, we'll try and grab it. I don't think it matters which one you play. I really hope not. I still remember playing this fella, so we'll go with that. 
Hmm. Those are some decent cards. Uh, do we want to go on the defensive? Eh, actually, let's do this. At least they'll have to use something decent to take it. Exactly. And now we can play on the defensive. Yeah, we'll go with that. Now they're basically screwed. So we can put that there, and then again, you, you just you can't take anything back. And then we can take you as well with that. Suck it. Freaking suck it. My god. You got whitewashed. Um, this was not bad. The Chimera, which I used to, by the way, when I was a kid, pronounce Chimera. It's not. It's Chimera. Or Chimera. Whatever. Hmm. Yeah, it seems decent. Alright, if you can whip out the card now, I'd like to do that. Cause I'd like to do that, because I gotta go get Zelda's card as well. And I gotta beat uh, Diablos. Or Di Diablos? Diablos? I don't know. Efforts, minimum, blah, 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 blah. Okay, so we're using the Chimera now as well. I really have to stop myself from saying Chimera. Um, if we put that there, he can take it with the Iron Giant or the Buell. He'll probably use the Buell, because the Buell is kind of crap. Yeah. Touche, sir, touche. What if I put this here? You can take it back. Hmm. Alright, here's what we're going to do. We are going to put that there. Keep the Katobo Pass for now. Not Katobo, I keep going to that, the, the Behemoth. Um, hmm. Can you take it from the right? You can't. Can you take it from down below? No, you can't. Or up above. So, if we do this, he will go for this from the top, and then we can take it... Hmm. Can we take it back? Yes, no matter what he plays, we can take it back. Well, maybe we should go for... The, well, no. Yeah, we'll do that. So I'm gonna take it from no, he can't take it from down below. Oh, you motherfucker! I still think we'll be fine. I'm hoping he does it from. Ah, I knew it. All right, so uh, if we do this, actually, wait, 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 wait. If I do that, it's gonna be open, and we'll just take it straight back. So we want to go here, really, or go here with Ifrit. Go here with Ifrit. He can't do anything. But then we're just, uh, we're just gonna get a draw. Hmm. That's annoying. But then, oh man. Yeah, I think, we're, I think we're gonna get a draw here. That sucks. Oh well. I don't think there's much we can do. Wait, I, uh, I fucked it up, didn't I? I put the wrong card down! No! He took my effort card! You know, instead of reloading the game... Oh, we got an achievement for that, thanks. Instead of reloading the game, let's just try and win our effort card back. Uh, hopefully he plays it straight away, or, you know, at least the quiz this one, so we'll have something. Of course, now not having the Ifrit card makes our deck considerably worse, and of course he's not playing it straight away. We'll give him a couple of games to whip it out. If he doesn't, I'll just reload the game, because, uh, frankly, I'm lazy. Right. I'll take you from there. That's a good card, by the way, the Biggs and Wedge one. And yes, there are cards of bosses as well. I think maybe every boss. I uh, sure will do that. Yeah, okay, it's looking good now. Again, we, we lost Ifrit, but he still has it, so he can play it again. I just play one of them, you know? Give a brother a break! No, 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 no. We want this. There you go. That's the problem, again. Until you start getting a whole bunch of good cards, losing Ifrit is, like, very detrimental to our success. But, you know, we'll, we'll give it a legit go here to win it back. Okay. At least he's playing it again. Why am I going first? You son of a bitch! Well, he can take... Even if we put that down, he can take it with Ifrit, so... Maybe we want him to do that so we can entice him to take it out. Yeah, let's do that, actually. He, he probably will play it. Okay, and then we can go here with this. Then I don't think he can take anything. No. Good. Uh, we take this with Minimog, but we're going to be open for attack if we do that. Hmm. As a question... Oh, my God. Um, I think we kind of have to, though, don't we? Really? Let's do that. Fuck it. Let's hope this works out for us. We do. Yeah. He can still take me. I think we're gonna get a draw here. So if I put this here, he's gonna obviously take it with the, the jelly eye. Which. No, we can actually take that. No, because he could take this back instead. But again, he'd have to play the jelly eye. Which we could still take. I think this will work. Yeah, okay. Good! I want a friggin' Ifrit card back! Screw you! Alright, now play the Quistus card, you son of a bitch. 
Again, I really don't think it matters which one. I think I remember switching between them sometimes, but yeah, I really don't think it matters. Still no Quester's card. Got a Ruby Dragon, though. Yeah, I think that's the one that you get still pipe from. Elastoid. No, it's not! No, I remember what it is. It's like, uh, it's green looking. It looks like a green monkey. Yeah, I remember now. Okay, so if we see a green monkey looking card, we need that because you get still pipes from that. Um, how do we take you? Not especially easily. Ah. Again, we use Minimog, but it's just going to be very open to attack. Hmm. Maybe we go defensive and go down here? Yeah, let's go with that. I knew he was going to do that. You son of a bitch. Ah, uh, uh, mm hmm. We can go defensive again. Let's go, go with this for now. Wait for him to open up. And then we can take that. He's going to take it straight back with... Actually, no, you can't, can you? No, he actually can't take it because his right-hand side's really weak. Okay, well, that works. Suck it. And then, as long as we play defensive here as well, we win. And we're taking that Ruby Dragon, you son of a bitch. You have to fight one of those later. Actually, fairly soon, I think. Uh, you'll see. It's pretty bloody tough from what I remember. Actually, no, that's probably a bit later in the game, but it's still tough either way. Anyway, uh, about that card, you know? Alright. Ah, so, ooh. Do you realize it was a Tomberry King card? Yeah, it totally is. Okay. I guess it really is for all the bosses. Um, hmm. Interesting. Very interesting indeed. Uh, we can take it from the right of Biggs and Witch. Or Ifrit. Well, why, why use Ifrit, you know? So if we do that, he's going to take it. Uh, basically guaranteed from the bottom with literally any of his cards. I still think we should do it, though. Or do we play defensive by going here? Because then he can't take it. Yeah, let's do that. He can't take it, right? No, he can't. Okay, good. Then, uh, we go defensive again. Still had three good cards. Shit, I put it in the wrong place. Oh my god. Fuck. That's really bad. Alright, we need to do this to take these two. Okay. We actually won despite me screwing up then. Woo! That was a little scary. Okay, I'm gonna take the, uh, the Tom Berry King. Thank you very much. Again, play the Quistus card. I mean, I appreciate winning all these cards, but... I almost lost that one. I did lose my effort card. I had to win it back. You know, these people aren't that easy. Plus, I'm apparently just not that great at the card game. Oh my god. So a green monkey thing. I can't remember what it's called, but I know what the card looks like. Um, take it from the right, Biggs and Wedge. Yes, yeah, do that. We're still fairly defensive. He'll probably use the Jelly Eye. Yes, he did. Then we can do uh, Ruby Dragon, I suppose. Put that there as well. Ah. Uh, Hmm. It's better to use this. Maybe. Maybe we'll do that. And hope he takes it from the left, which he probably will. It's kind of what we were looking for, yes. Ah, Ifrit, goddammit. Well, we can take that. Hmm, we can take that. Hmm, mm, questions. Uh, what do we want to do here? See, we could go with Minimog to take that. Or, it, or like, yeah, hmm. Alright, let's do this. I think this will work out. Yes, it will. Especially if we... I think. If we do this, he can take it... No, he can't take it back. Okay. GG. Well, plus, alright, any of these good... Oh, Elnoil. I thought it was called Elveret. If it's Elnoil, I don't know. There is something called Elverit. Uh, yeah, it's like a robot thing. G U I M four seven N. Maybe that's supposed to be like Gimatin. I don't know. Um, yeah, we'll take Elnoil. I really want to go fight Diablos again, but I want this bloody card before I do it. Give me the card, you son of a bitch! Please, please, I have other things to do, man. We got other cards to get and bosses to beat. Thank you! Fucking finally! Here's the thing, we have to go first, which really sucks. Urgh. Oh, that's so annoying. Shit. Alright, we want to entice her to use it. She has an A. So I'm thinking... Bear with me here. If we put this here... Well, no, she would... Ah, God damn it, Minimog. I mean, if we put this here, she'll almost certainly take it with the Quistus card. This is risky, 
Because we're using our Ifrit to do it. I don't know if that's a good idea. Maybe we shouldn't. Maybe we... Mm. Alright, let's do this. And hope she takes it with Quistus. She did not. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. Oh, that's so bad. Alright, let's do this. Okay! I can actually take you, but you take my Ifrit back. Is that worth doing? You can take Ifrit with anyone. Um... I don't know if that's worth doing. I think we should go on the defensive here. Yeah, let's do that. Alright. If we take you, you'll definitely take it back with either of those. But with either of those, we can take it back with their threat. And then you lose, motherfucker! Oh, you just went... Why would you do that? Well, whatever. Give him the freaking card, you sons of bitches. Alright. Card get door. And we can get the hell out of here and never play these people of cards ever again. Again, we still got to get Zell's, mother's card, or Zell's card from his mother. Can't you try the hot dogs here or something? I feel like that's the thing. We're not open yet. Oh. Well, fuck you then, cafeteria lady. Oh my god. You see this little running boy? You bet your ass I'm gonna go save her right now. And then again, we'll try Diablos again. Uh, we'll give him like one... Basically, I'll do like one more unedited attempt. If he kills me again... What we'll probably do is, um, I'll start cutting out at least the beginning of the fight until we've got like a few demis off. And I'll show you it from that point, something like that. But you know, since this is only our second real attempt, if we don't include the first time, because I didn't really know what I was doing, uh, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll just leave in the whole thing, because I'm hoping we don't just fail like hell with the demis, because if you can get the demis off quickly, he gets less time to sort of end up doing that bullshit three hit combo on you really fast and wiping out everyone. Also, I feel like putting the timer on, um,. Where is it? Config? I feel like putting the battle on weights is going to give us more of a chance for him to not do that. So let's go with that. Alright, I just saved it. Let's not save it again. Well, I do need to remember the uh, the config if I fuck it up. Okie dokie. I did save it after getting that card right. I really bloody hope so. I love the music. I love it. Alright. Okay. Oh, you son of a bitch. Draw a cast. Again, we'll just do this with everyone. Yeah, just do Demi on like a couple of people. I'll be fine with it. Good, excellent start, thank you. I feel like he doesn't take much damage from like anything. Maybe I'm wrong. I feel like elements are really bad on him. That also did not do as much as it did last time. I thought it was guaranteed to do like a percentage. Interesting. Terrifying as well. Oh my crest. Oh god. Stop failing, stop failing, stop failing! Stop failing, you bastards! Maybe we should use our... Like, Zell's uh, limit break? I mean, it was there. I guess we'll try if it shows up again. It did not, of course. Oh, shit. Item, Phoenix down, right bloody now. Alright, selfies is working, let's do this. Full and do over, aura. Blizzard-ga? Blizzard-ra, full cure, fire, fire-ra. Blizzard, he's attacking whilst we're doing this. Let's do thunder -ra. Alright, um, alright, we don't need Phoenix down yet. Demi cast. Demi cast, please, bloody work! Please do better than the fire or whatever we used last time, because that was piss poor. Ah, it's still really bad. I should have just taken the blizzard gun. Alright, at least we got another Demi off. We can definitely do this, and the earlier you get him, the more AP he can, you know, earn. Quicker. So it's definitely- oh shit. It's definitely a good idea. Item, item, item. Phoenix down. Go, go, go. Shit, 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 shit. Okay, oh my god, don't do that. Don't do that. That is terrifying. Please, 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 please. Phoenix down! Phoenix down, damn you! Ah, uh, we might be in like an endless loop of death here, because he's really quick. Unless he does Demi again. Let's go on what we- no, 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 no! Stop it! Use Demi, you shit! He's not using it. Why is he not using Demi now? Does he, does he do this on, like, low HP or something? Oh, thank you. That's fine! That's fine! Keep doing that! We don't have that many things down as well, is the problem. We gotta use another one here. Draw, please! Demi him! Again, we want Demi to start doing jack shit, then we know we can finish him off quickly with summon. Stop it. Stop it right now. Draw, Demi, cast. Oh god. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Thank you, thank you. Alright. Because I was going to be revived, we got another Demi off. It's going reasonable. But again, he will just... 
He can't just crack you off really quick with his physical attacks. If you could just stop doing that, I'd really appreciate it. Uh, oh shit! Cost, cost it quickly! I don't Phoenix down. He fell. Um, we might be better off just spamming our summons at this point. Oh my god! All right. Oh shit! I don't Phoenix down. Oh, you, and why are you not on the Phoenix down? GF, go go go! Just, the thing is, well, when you're summoning, as you've seen, uh, the GSHP pops up, so that's just going to give us some defense. So you know, uh, Siren's going to be really bad. Shiva. All right. We gotta stop doing Demi now, for the most part, and we're gonna hope we can finish him off with this. We've done a good chunk of damage real quick. I have to mash the hell out of it. Also, gonna speed it up. Also, actually, no, I'm not, because that's gonna make mashing really difficult. Oh my god. Please. Just let me kill you. Do decent damage, damn you. I don't think this is gonna do very much. He seems to be really strong against elements. Please. That's not that bad, actually. That's not that bad. It's a lot better than I thought it was gonna be. We got two more coming. Good, 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 good. Uh, draw. We'll go with. Since she's ready, we'll try a demi. Kind of rhymes. Again, I'm usually going to be cutting these out, but since it's a boss battle and not an especially long one, assuming things go our way, I'll leave them in. Oh my god, that wasn't a great boost. This thing is seizure inducing, man. It's like horrible to look at. That's not great. Oh, good, 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 good. How much is he gonna do? I'm gonna guess not very much, because it must be low on HP by now, right? I think. Yes, it's pretty low on HP. Please, please kill it with Shiva. I, it's gonna kill me in a second. Please. All right, almost over boosted that. Again, I didn't never explain it, but if you uh, are boosting when the Red Cross comes up, uh, it just resets the boost counter entirely. And then you do, like, half damage. So it's not good. He's not going to be there, I don't think. No. He's, he's, he's nearly there. Shit. Don't do that. Uh, GF again. Ifrit, go, 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 go. We need the defense more than anything, just from the HP. Shit. Uh, we have, like, one more. Yeah, okay. No more revives now. You know, the thing is, if he dies right now, which he might... Uh, school's not gonna get any AP for the battle. It's not the end of the world. Like, it's really not, but... It's still gonna be a decent chunk of AP that he's gonna be missing out on for his summons. Or summon? I think he has two of them as well. I think he's got Siren and Quasicuddle. Something like that. This might kill him. Or he's gonna be very low after this. Is he still alive? Uh, I, I really wish he just died, honestly. Oh, dear God. Don't combo me anymore. Oh, fuck. Oh, come on, man. Well, he's down and out. Oh, now you do gravity. Oh, you son of a bitch. Why well, didn't we can kill him? Again, losing the AP on school sucks. But it's really not a huge deal. Like, five minutes grinding on enemies, you can make it back. Depending on how much it is. Please, just kill him. Between this and Shiva, it must be enough. He must be nearly dead. Okay, again, not a great boost, but good enough, I guess. Probably gonna do sort of like 550, something like that. 674, it's not bad. Come on, die! Die, damn you! Die, damn you! We have no more revives and our people are on like jack shit HP. Two more physical attacks, we're done. We, we can't do anything about it, because we don't have life yet. That's why fighting this guy at this point is really hard. When you get life, ain't that bad. I mean, still pretty bad. That was a powerful boost. Please kill him. Uh, he's not dead. Shit. Shit, 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 shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Don't screw me now. He's so nearly dead. Again, the freaking gravity's demi whatever's doing like nothing. How can you have this much HP left? Doesn't make any damn sense. Ah! Don't mess up the boost, whatever you do. No, 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 no. All right, 125. Not that bad. Please, you need to die now, or or do gravity. Die or do gravity. Die or do gravity. Oh my god. Too much sleep, too weak. We beat him. Jesus Christ, man. That was to the wire. We got the Diablos achievement. How much AP did we lose there? And we got the card as well. I forgot about that. 20. 
It's really not that much, honestly. Okay, so we got a um, couple of abilities there. I believe we got the card mod now. So let's have a look. Uh, it's a Quesicle, I think? It learns card mod? Yes. So what do we want to get now? Probably Vitality Junction. So again, we can Junction Magic to our Vitality to boost it. I don't remember what Vitality does. Because it's not, you know, HP. HP is HP. I don't remember what Spirit is either. Again, I think Spirit might be a summon damage. I remember. So we've got Elemental Attack Junction. We're learning there. And Ifrit is learning HP Junction. Siren is learning... Something we don't really want her to learn. Do we want a second status def defense junction? Mm. I think refining status recovery medicine from an item is really handy, if I remember. Life recovery magic from an item. Hmm. Let's try learning these. We'll go with life recovery first, because, again, if we can get, like, some life spells early, that would be nice. Alright, so we also have the Di Diablos we need to equip. This puts your encounter rate down by half. Probably something... That's a really good move, isn't it, Dark Side? Yeah, it's a command that you can learn. You can also learn Muck. 200 bloody AP to learn that. Let's get Encounter Rate Half first, so that we... When I don't want to grind, we can equip that. And we'll put Diablos on Zell, I think. Because, you know, apparently I'm sexist. What do you have? Yeah, Quizzle Called the Siren, and she's got Ifrit. Seems fine to me, and we're nearly all dead. Can we revive them with a tent? Let's have a look. Tents work? Yes, they do. Okay. Well, that was, uh, that was a pain in the deck. We've been going for 41 bloody minutes already. I'm probably going to count, like, maybe five minutes. Probably not even that much. All right, so let's see if we can get this card and then uh, maybe begin our journey before we end the episode. I want to at least get, you know, out of this place. But, um, again, there's a lot of loose ends we needed to tie up here. We got the card. We beat Diablos. We got him equipped. We're learning some new abilities. We have card mod, which, speaking of which, let's see if I can remember how to do that. So you go to card and then click on the card, maybe? How do you do it? Why do I not remember how to do this? Oh, ability. There you go. Then, so you can turn the geezers into five screws. Screws. Good work, brain. Screws. What do you get for Ochu? Ochu Tentacle. We don't need two Ochu cards. Let's do that. Number, number to refine one. Yes. This is something that, you know, Dark Souls that came out 20, almost 20 years later. Didn't do! Using more than one thing at once. And then again, Fallout 4 doesn't do it either. So we'll turn three of those. May as well just mod all of our spare cards. That's all of them, I think. Yes. What's a Diablo card like? Diablos, whatever. It's gonna be back here. Yes, yeah, pretty good actually. She's got an A. Which A is, um... Uh, it's a 10, basically. Alright. Uh, I'm just trying to think. We need still need Zell's card. Is there anything else I'm missing here? Oh, there's another thing. I don't think I mentioned this, but I drew a hundred scans on everyone from those bug things that I mentioned I was going to do. Again, it would have been real nice to get a hundred demi on everyone. But as you saw, just beating that guy was a pain in the dick. So fighting him long enough to drain a hundred demis on everyone, basically impossible at this point in the game. Plus, you saw it was failing constantly. We were getting like one if we were getting any, so... We take a really long time, so you know to hell with that. Anyway, let's use our speed thing. Holy shit, that's really hard to control. <laughs> I really like that it doesn't speed up the music, because that's usually why I don't use speed up things like that, because you know, it messes with the music. That's a cat. This is, is it ain't even the cell's house, man. Hey, a save point around here is there? No, not really. I guess there's one in the hotel. Slow it down again. Sup, how's it going? Good to see you, Zell. You look stronger every time I see you. Well, yeah, I guess so. Been raging up a storm all over the place. That's very good, but... Here, in Balam, my boy is doing the same, trying to be like you. I don't know who her boy is. Yo, so are you saying it's my fault? Apparently she is. I think you can't challenge her until you leave and come back in. I think she won't play cards right now. Yes, have you improved your game? Apparently she will. You know what? I'm actually going to leave and come back in and see if this person disappears. Because look at a strange feeling. She won't have the card again or something. Because that would really piss me off. Oh, apparently it doesn't work. Well, whatever. I didn't mean to, uh, to talk to you. It looks up to you. He can't help it. We still can't go up here, right? I think there's something good up there. I can't, can't. Yeah, I can't. All right, whatever. What up? Yes, I have improved my game. Let's do this. Alright, I guess we may as well do this at double speed, because it's kind of slow anyway. Diablos, oh my god, we have so many decent cards. We've almost got a full, you know, five of rare ones, and when we get Zell's card, we will. 
There it is! That's the one, the one in the middle. The monkey thing. Alright, that's handy. Um, this is a really good card. I like that. We can go defensive. Yeah, let's do that. Actually, it's probably kind of a waste. You could probably go defensive here and... Yeah, you can't take me with anything. That's, that's a better bet. Then... Uh, well, yeah, I could do that. Probably should do this instead. Well, no, you can take me from the right. But you can only take me with the couple. And we'd at least bait it out. I guess it would be better just to do that. And then you'll take it from below. Then we can do this. And you'll take it back. Then we do that. And then whatever you put down, we can take because mini mark. That's where you want mini mark. It's sort of an up down finish. When do you go? There you go. I'm even going to refine the card now, even though it's our only one. We'll get more, because uh, again, you need the pipe. I think maybe we even need the pipe now. Let's go to the weapon store over here. Should trigger, yep, and one steel pipe. And we'll put our strength from 23 to 26. What does it cost? I don't even know. Can we do any of these other ones? We need a dragon fin. Don't remember where you get those. Don't have that for her yet. So the first one is the one that they already have. So Zell has a new weapon we can make. Uh, we don't need, don't have the dragon fin, and we just need the pipe for this. So let's use our card mod ability. Card mod. Uh, Wendigo, where are you? There you are. Yep. Once. Oh, steel orb. Wait a minute. Steel orb. Wait, what? Could have sworn that's where you get the pipe. Apparently, I'm wrong. That's depressing. Maybe you can turn this... I don't even remember a steel orb being an item. Maybe you can turn a steel orb into a pipe or something? I, I, I'm confused now. Alright, anyway. Oh my god, stop it. Again, if you can whip out the card quickly, because no one else has so far, that would be very handy. Because, you know, as much as I like the cards, I kind of want to get on with the story now. Nope. Alright. Still going at speed. Yes, double speed, whatever. Um, Yeah, let's go defensive again. And we'll take... Oh, didn't see that. Shit. Err, uh, in that case, we'll do that. And then you'll take it back. Sure, that's fine, because then we can... We Actually, we can't take them both. Oh, you fuckers. Oh, actually, yeah, yeah, we can. But then... We can take them both back with that stupid robot -y thing. Oh, you motherfucker. Alright, well, in that case, we'll do a mini mark there. We'll only take one. But then... We can do that, and we still win. Actually, no, we draw. Well, whatever. Yeah, man, I want anyway. You suck. Give me the card. My god. Nope. Um. Do I want to go defensive? Is this going to work? Let's, let's be a little bit more careful here. Yes. Okay. Then we could take it with Diablos, and you have to take it from down below. I think we'll do that just to entice you to pull out some of your better shit. And then. We can take you with either of these. I guess we'll do it with that one. Actually, you could take my Quistis card if I do that. But you'd have to take it with something weak. Yeah, I guess it wouldn't really matter too much either way. Let's do that. It'll probably draw out that one. Yes, it did. And then we can do that. And again, since we have the Minimog ready, boom. It's kind of ideal, really, having, again, this sort of up-down and having the Minimog left. Um, we'll take the... Turd upon, I guess. Again, we're not going to be using it, but, you know, whatever. Challenge me, damn it! She's one of those people that takes forever to speak to her between car games. So I'm really glad we have the double speed thing here, even though it's making clicking kind of difficult. Hey, there we go, alright. Um, 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 um. Hmm. Take the thing, thing. If I... Oh, God. Oh, whoa, 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 buttons. If I do this, he cannot take it even with the Zell card, which means he's probably not going to use it. He might, though. I'd like him to draw. I'd like to draw it out of him if I could. Again, though, that's risky. Uh, this will probably just make him use the uh, thing in the middle. I can't remember what it's called now. El, not Elverit, whatever it was called. Um. Oh man. Uh. Hmm. I guess we'll go defensive. I don't want to do it, but hopefully he uses Elka. Good. 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 Then we'll take you, and then you have to take me from down below. Yes. If I take you from here, you cannot take it back. And you've just fucked yourself! Well done! Uh... Yes! Okay, this is perfect. And we have the Minimark. Just for backup. Zelda God! 
get to her. There we go. That's all I wanted to do. Let's slow down the game again. And what were you? Thunder. Anyone we'll need that? No. So again, we go into the left. Again, that was uh, the part of the game right here where I got stuck for fucking hours. Because I didn't know you could go left to get to the station. Because they don't tell you that. It really sucked. It really, really sucked. I right, was going to save. Because, you know, again, just in case. And interestingly enough, um, I think we might be able to start a quest here, though I don't remember exactly. Basically, there's a chick here called... Oh, we got some more money from uh, being a seed. Again, I think that happens like every hour or something. There's a chick here called the Card Queen, and uh, she has a side quest where you can win a bunch of rare cards, but I don't remember how the side quest works or how to activate it or anything. And the thing about the Card Queen, that's her right there, uh, is she starts... Basically... Triple Triad has a lot more rules than what we've been playing as playing with right now. Uh, the way rules change is in different regions, but also if you go to a different region, play with their rules, and then go back to say Balam Garden or whatever, you'll actually spread those rules like a bloody virus into Balam Garden. Which is one of the things I really don't like about the card game, because I like the basic version of Triple Triad. I don't like it when they add the elements and all kinds of weird shit. Like, um, there's, there's like one called Flip or something where they kind of chain together. So you'll flip one card and it will flip over like four of them on the bloody board. I mean, I could never get the hang of that when I was a kid. Maybe I'll be a bit better at it now, I don't know. But essentially, the Card Queen also can spread rules. We've just saved it. I don't want her to spread rules. However, we've done everything we want to do in Balam. We've got all the cards around here, so I guess it doesn't really matter. However, because I can't remember how her side quest works, and I want to make sure we do it, I'm actually going to uh, just make a quick cut here, look it up, just to make sure, because I might have to play her before we leave or something. So, I want to make sure if we do, then we do it. So, I'll be right back. Alright, I'm back. I'm not going to lie to you, this is kind of confusing as hell. Essentially, it says you have to lose specific rare cards to her, uh, in order to have her uh, allow you to get other rare cards. Now, apparently you can do this all uh, on disc 3, but... That's a long ways away. Uh, so, what this suggests is losing... Again, I think I did do this quest at some point, but I don't think I ever did it until disc 3. So we're going to try and do this as we go along. So we're going to try losing the minimal card to her, and then that should work. And then we can win it back at some point. Now, here's the thing. I can't seem to find out online if you can just win the card back straight away. But again, since you can do it on disc 3, I'm going to try losing Minimog. Actually, no, I, well, I guess... I guess the only way to, I guess, if I play Minimog and use a bunch of shit cards, she will take that. So anyway, I guess we're going to lose the Minimog and then try and win it back straight away. If we get it back straight away, cool. Uh, that might break the quest, at least for now. We might have to lose, lose it to her for a while. I don't know. Because she, basically, she moves town. So we might not be able to get it back until the next town or something. Um, but it sounds like you might be able to win it back straight away. So we're going to go with that theory. Also, let's speak to her properly before we do anything. I'm the Queen of Cards. I travel all over the world to monitor and enforce the various card rules. What do you want to know? This region's rules, the current trend of the trading rules, how are the rules passed on? I guess we'll ask that, even though I, I can't actually get out of here without saying something. Basically, each region has its own rules. The rules you're carrying are passed on as you travel to various regions. As for the trading rules, they gradually spread out from a region where the card game is most popular. Of course, this region can change constantly depending on your course and actions. Which my presence in a region can change its trading rules at times. Yeah, she's a bit of a bitch like that. Hello, you wish to challenge me? Yes, I do. So she has the direct rule. Here's the thing, I know what the bloody hell that does. I should probably just log it up. Oh, whoa, 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 We're losing Minimark. Though I really don't want to. Uh, yeah, there you go. Let's just play like a plunker. Take it, take me! And then we'll be like, uh, dare. Gee, boss, I don't know how to play cards, boss. Let's do that. Just make absolutely certain that she loses. Lovely. So took one of you by mistake. Whoa, 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 what happened? Bite bug. I got the bite bug. She took two of my cards? I don't really care about that card. Well, she got the mock card. Alright, let's try and win it back now. This region is getting boring. I'm going to head towards Dolitz. Oh. We can't replay her right now. But there you go. So I guess we can't win the Minimog card back until we get into Dolitz. We're going to go with this, because apparently this is the way you do this thing. Uh, it's a little annoying that we don't have the Minimog now, but hey, look on the bright side. We do have some balling cards. It was arguably our worst one. So whatever. 
Uh, so anyway, we can get the bag when we go to Donna. Hey, you have a pretty nice physique. Thanks, baby. I'm a professional photographer. I want to be a spotlight technician. Why do you need one? There's going to be a big parade in Albania, and I'm thinking of going. I want to take a lot of nice pictures and sell them and make big money. Big prizes! We'll split everything 70-30. Actually, how about 80-20? You know what? Forget about it. Well, alright. I think we have to buy tickets here, and I think you need money. And I also think I remember spending all of my... Wait a minute! Oh, that's right. We don't have the pipe. I was like, I forgot to upgrade my weapon. I think I remember spending all of my money, even though I can't remember where our bloody hell our store is, uh, and then not being able to buy a ticket here because you need like two grand or something, and I had to wait like an hour for me to get an exceed payment. It's kind of annoying. Gift shop employee, do you need to buy anything before you go? We carry various gifts to. Oh, this must be where I spent all of my money. Um, let's see if we can figure out how much money we need for the ticket first, because that was probably what happened. I probably spent it all there. Hello. This train to Timber is here. Please purchase a train ticket. Yeah, three bloody grand. Please go inside right away. The train to Timber will be leaving shortly. I'm going inside right away. I'm going to spend the rest of my cash. I don't think we need cash right now. Besides, you know, buying stuff. Uh, what we definitely need is some bloody Phoenix Downs. Holy crap, they're expensive. Wow. We'll get ten. Potions, we have like none of. Man, that sucks. I guess we'll get like ten of those. I guess we'll get another ten. And then what else do we want? Probably at least some of these. We'll buy like five of each, I guess. Oh man, this is gonna like really break the bank. Five antidotes, five soft, five echo screen. Now, most of these, again, they, they say what they do there, so I'm not gonna explain them. Uh, holy water is not a huge deal, but we'll take them as well. Remedies are really good. Tents are also really good. We, we don't have very much at all. We can only afford like one more thing. G potion, G returner. Hmm. Got plenty of G returners right now, so let's go with a tent, I suppose. And we have 500 gil left. We can sell a bunch of shit, though. Uh, what do we have here that's valuable? Alexias. Oh, very valuable. We don't need the money right now, but if we get desperate, we can always sell some of the stuff. And again, that's why refining cards is very handy, because you can see you can make money that way. By the time you get to the point where you can just, um kind of infinitely get the rare cards back. Again, I'm not going to explain that until we get there, but there is a way of doing it on Disc 4, I think. I'm pretty sure it's not until Disc 4. Uh, you, what you can do is just turn a rare card into some amazing shit that sells for a lot of money, sell it all, get the card back, and keep doing it again and again. And then you end up with like 9999999999 gil. So, yeah. That's a way of breaking the friggin' game. We have been going for about an hour, but we're going to keep going a little bit longer until we get to the next save point, I guess. So far, all the seeds that I have seen off have come back safely, so there's nothing for you to worry about. Have a safe trip. Thanks, buddy! And... I think we walk up the stairs, maybe? Yes, we do! Don't remember if there's a safe... Basically, there's, um... How do I explain this without spoiling it? There's a lengthy part coming up with no saving between. Okay, there is a safe point here. Good. This train is awesome! A transcontinental railroad, baby! It even runs through an underwater tunnel to get to Timber. Pretty cool, huh? Sure is. <laughs> Guess you're not interested. By the way, school, you have to use the ticket to get inside. You have to use it on the door or the machine or something. I am not controlling him right now. Okay, we can go inside now. Confirming access granted. I'm gonna go check out the front. Woo! Tee, thanks. Yeah, she's like a very girly girl. Let's go check it out, school. So yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. Wow, choked on air then. So yes, yeah, very lengthy section coming up here. Very interesting, very cool, very unexpected the first time you play the game. Uh, and that's what we're going to be starting pretty much the next episode with. So I'm going to end it here. Thanks for joining me. If you enjoyed it, I always appreciate it. Like, and I will see you next time for more Final Fantasy VIII.